Hi, welcome to my unboxing video of the new Asus GeForce GT610. Not sure how new it is. This is a basic card for HD video playback and that sort of stuff. It is not at all designed for gaming. So let's see exactly what you get in the box. Alright, so let's take a look inside and see exactly what we get with the GeForce GT610 by Asus. Bear in mind, I do enjoy Asus products. Um, just about every product I've had from them has been of a high quality, and I enjoyed the reliability, stability, and well, just about everything you can enjoy from a computer from the from their products. So this one has got a little fan on it. Um, I'm not sure exactly at the moment how loud the fan is, but I will confirm this in the description on the video when I eventually plug it in and give it a try. So, you can, you can see you got DVI, HDMI and VGA output, so it gives you maximum compatibility. Um, we're not seeing DisplayPort on any of these cards yet, because they are value cards. These retail at about 39 99 of course you can get them cheaper on mine um, and they are low profile so this should come with a bracket so let's have a look and that's right it comes with not what it comes with two brackets so you can actually mount these side by side so you have a double bracket graphics card so you can ha still have the VGA if you say got two back plates on your low profile PC case which isn't always the case in which case you could just use this one which gives you DVI and VGA and uh, HDMI sorry and if you do need VGA you can always use an adapter so compatibility is a maximum now you'll notice that they've stopped using the black capacitors that kept on popping these are high quality capacitors and they do last many many years is what we like to see on graphics cards. Now the VGA is very easily removable. You can see there, it has um, a plug which can easily be unclipped. Um, I'm not going to do it now. Um, and then you can just basically unscrew them, these uh, screws, and take the VGA plug out. Or you can just take the whole back plate off and replace uh, with one of these. So what else do we get in the box? Well. Besides the graphics card back plates, you get the Asus Speed Setup Guide, which is a speed setup guide. Comes in many, many languages. Don't worry, it's not all in English, so you haven't got a lot to look through. And you also come with the all essential driver disc. As soon as you install this and get your driver set up, you want to have a look and see if there are updated drivers. That is the most essential thing you want to do. So. Let's uh, have one more look at the back of the card and uh, let's go over the specs of what this card has. So it comes with um, a dust proof fan apparently. So this fan is apparently dust proof, it will not collect dust. 25% um, longer lifespan, GPU tweak real-time graphics tuning. I do not think that means overclocking, I think that means optimizing. You got one gigabyte of DDR3, it's not fast memory, I think it's 64-bit, whereas the gaming cards have 128-bit. It does make a huge noticeable difference. This card is not for gaming, it is for basic media playback. Um, and obviously we already know this, low profile bracket included. So, you also get 15% performance boost, 35 degree cool operations, 2.5% uh, 2.5 uh, 2 times along the lifespan. So, if we look on the back of the box, it just gives a more detailed overview of what this card can do. The exclusive alloy components can help boost performance by reducing power loss. Enhancing durability and achievement cooler operation. The chokes concrete core ele eliminates the buzz sound in full load while the class is a 50,000 hour lifespan equivalent to 2.5 times longer than traditional capacitors. So you got a longer lifespan there instantly. <coughs> 
Um, would I recommend this card? Well, I haven't tried it yet, but Nvidia and Asus low profile cards, not a lot can really go wrong with them. I haven't heard of these sort of basic cards failing. They don't go under much stress and they're very well built. So I would recommend. So let's um, put this all away and we'll give it a go later and we'll post the results in the description. Thanks for watching. Uh, this is the Speck Techie. Don't forget to rate and subscribe to this video. Thank you.